Welcome to Simply Logical. This is Vengtesh. In this reasoning missing number problem, you are asked to find the number which replaces question mark based on the logic associated with other equations. Can you find the missing number? You are supposed to find the logic associated in each equation representation and then find the missing number. Finding the logic behind this puzzle is simple if you just think little harder. Feel free to pause the video and give it a try before checking the solution. Once done, continue watching the video for the right answer. I will be back in 10 seconds. Let me explain the solution now. If LHS is represented as A plus B, RHS can be break down into three parts. The first part is a difference of two numbers. The second part is sum of two numbers and third part is product of two numbers. Let's validate this logic. In the first equation, A is equal to 7 and B equals 3. According to the logic, first part is 7 minus 3 which is equal to 4. Second part is 7 plus 3 which is equal to 10. Third part is 7 times 3 which is equal to 21. And hence RHS is 4, 1, 0, 2, 1 which is validated. And in the second equation A is equal to 8, B is equal to 3. According to the logic, first part is 8 minus 3 equals 5. Second part is 8 plus 3 equals 11. Third part is 8 times 3 which is equal to 24 and so RHS is 5 double 1 2 4. In the third equation A equals 5 B equals 4 according to the logic first part is 5 minus 4 which is equal to 1. Second part is 5 plus 4 which is equal to 9 and third part is 5 times 4 which is equual to 20 hence RHS is 1920. And the similar logic is applied to all the equation. Let's find the missing number according to the logic. So in the final equation, A equals 17, B equals 8. Hence first part is 17 minus 8 which is equal to 9. Second part is 17 plus 8 equals 25. Third part is 17 times 8 which is equal to 136. Hence RHS is 925136. Hence answer to this particular problem is 925136. By using this simple logic, we can solve this particular reasoning missing number puzzle in simple steps. That's all for this video. Let me know for any questions. I will try to address as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Let's meet in the next video with one more interesting problem. Thank you.